So this is basically like suicide. <clears throat> I got the LP4 in there. Uh, it's a 2020 Bison. I'm not gonna leave it in there because, as uh, you could see, these uh, side LEDs. I'm not gonna be able to uh, take advantage of them since it's gonna be blocked out. There's gonna be these two in the front. 7200 uh, lumens you know it's more than enough but you know with these side ones it gives you like 600 lumens extra a piece so I'm just gonna keep them up there for whenever I do need them but you know there's a uh, guys out there that probably do have the money and don't even care so in case uh, some of you guys out there were wondering they do fit on here um I'm just gonna put these SA squadrons on there that way I can use them out in the street and uh, don't have to worry about uh, taking them on and off when I get back home which is uh, sort of cool because they're better than the stock uh, fog lights so that's a plus and um, I can just keep them there because I, I don't leave those mounted on there it's way too expensive of a light you know for someone to just uh, be able to come and take off that one bolt or I don't know I'm kind of paranoid I'm like thinking someone can grab like a sawzall and just cut it off really quick but that's gonna be like a one one in a million chance anyways uh there it is in case some of you were wondering if it fit I have the uh, AEV Bison, just the AEV aftermarket bracket goes on right here. It's a hassle. Let's remove all this. Hopefully, it'll pop back in by some miracle of God. Anyways, uh, I'll get back to installing this SAE complaint, like so I don't blind half the world out there. Be responsible with your LEDs. And don't blind people just because you can. So normally that's how the uh, Bajas designs uh, fit. There's some space, and uh, I bought a spacer, and um, now you can see they're a little bit more flush. And um, I'm actually gonna when I take give myself some time and um, like glue or like a metal bracket trace this out cut it so um, you can't really see in here but at the same time it's kind of cool because it helps um, cool down the, the Baja design when the air flows through but we'll see what happens anyways uh, I put this little spacer on well, uh, Home Depot a dollar for two of them and this little bracket so it, it can push it up front because uh, the one it has on there, um, I pushed it as high up and as far forward as I could. And uh, as you can see, it still needs to go up a little bit more and forward a little bit more. Which is what I'm doing right here. I uh, couldn't justify spending a hundred bucks. or like I think it was like 200 bucks more for the XLs. And it does the same light out, but you know, if I would have spent the 200 bucks more, I could have got, um, what is it, the Pro Sports or something like that. And, um, anyways, uh, enough with, uh, money and all that and budgets, but, like I said, um, you know, little, uh, bracket, uh, plate, whatever you want to call it two holes so it'll fit on there and it's it's not it's thick so you know it's not gonna bend you can get you can do washers I just got this cuz it's a little bit easier to just do one instead of doing like five washers you know so hope you guys liked it and that's the SAE light pattern with headlights pretty bright. I mean, headlights you can see where it's focused. Right there. I mean, that's just right there, but uh, 
looks nice, nice complimentary and it works good uh, out on the street. <laughs>